Hey, Aquas. Okay, I hope y'all are doing well this evening. I feel amazing. I really do. Um, even though it's like pouring down complete rain outside, uh, clearing out the energy, perfect. Do it, perfect. Uh, it just feels. It feels a. Like a free as a bird, not pent down, um, relaxation. Okay, okay. I know this is going to sound weird. I've never been to a spa, but when I watch it on the movies, 55 on the clock, when I watch it on the movies, that is what I'm feeling. Like the feeling that I get when I'm watching Okay, that was from earlier. Um, the feeling that I get, the peaceful feeling and the relaxation feeling that I get from watching the the movies that have like the women going to the spa and all that. Somebody may end up like surprising you with the spa day and taking you to the spa. I don't know why the spa came up, but we're going to roll with it, okay? Okay, before I even start shuffling... I'm going to go ahead. I started burning my incense. I found my incense, y'all. I found my incense. I burn them when my boyfriend's not here. Because <laughs> he doesn't like the smell. But this one is the root chakra incense. Um, I like burning it. But since I found them, I am so happy. So, so, so happy. Okay, thank you, spirits. I already prayed over the cards. I'm going to go ahead and cleanse out the energies. And then, I don't know if we're going to use any over here. I don't plan on it, but if the divine says pool, I'm going to pool. Mm. Trying not to burn myself. <laughs> Cause I did that one time and I had a little burnt mark right here. Don't mind my hair. I don't even care. They used to flip me out like when I was younger, because I believe it started when I was in high school. Um until this day I I'm still trying to figure out what causes it for women. Um there is a term for it. I should actually look that up. Um, but I noticed that a lot of women go through that. I think we have more... Um, what is that? We have more of the masculine hormone than the feminine or something like that. I don't know. Maybe the roles are about to switch where the masculine is about to be the feminine in the feminine role and the feminine is about to be in the masculine role. Okay, we got to see. Okay, spirit. Is the roles about to be switched for the feminine and masculine? Is the masculine going to be in the feminine role and the feminine going to be in the masculine role? Okay. If it's a yes, it will move. If it's a no, it will stay still. Okay. Are the roles about to be switched between masculine and feminine? yes okay so the roles are about to be flipped so that could that could be um the energy flipper i don't know why but show me a penguin okay somebody may want to take you to the zoo i know penguins have zoo uh where else has zoo australia no not the hell, Australian don't have zoo? Why I just hear that? What the hell? Somebody said Australia. <laughs> 441 on the clock. Okay, so somebody might want to take you to Australia. Something out of the ordinary is what, okay. Yeah, out of the ordinary. I drank it. Get you a water. That's what you need right now for your throat.
And then did you brush your teeth before you go brush your teeth? Did you brush it after dinner or before dinner? It was when you was in there doing your faith, uh, your self care, right? Yeah. Okay. You ate again. Okay. So I need you to go in there and I need you to brush your teeth. Okay. It's still hot, baby. I can't. We, we live on the third floor. It's going to be hot. The lady up underneath us or the next door neighbor probably has their heat on. That's why it's so hot. Open the window over here. So then it will get a breeze going in between both windows. I'm not turning on my air. I'm sorry. It's too. <laughs> Shoot. That bill that month. Too much. I'm playing with them. They gonna get their money, but still, golly. And I'm still trying to trying to work this dang auto and this on thing. I ended up switching my thing to auto and my light bill because everything's collected. My lights, my gas, and my heat. Um, well, I don't have gas. My lights and my heat are connected. Okay, so I turned it on auto because it was on on. I should have left it on on because I honestly don't know the difference between either of them. Because when I switched when I switched it to auto, okay, so my usual bill is like ninety eight dollars. Man, I switched it to auto last month. My bill this month is day near three hundred dollars. It's like two fifty eight. I'm like, what the heck? What the heck? Are you serious? Oh my God, Spirit. Are you serious? Like, what? 7-Eleven on the clock. Yeah. That had me tripped completely up. I looked at that bill. I said, man. <laughs> It'll be paid. I, will, I wanted to go off completely. But that's the only bill that I pay in my house. So, like, I really can't. I'm not bad. I'm not bad. We got light a candle. 33 could be significant. There's that upside down. So, uh, yeah, for me talking about my life bill, make sure y'all paying attention with um, overspending. When it comes to that, you might end up having an unexpected bill like that in the mail um that might set your uh i just heard your free activity spending so like your um so like if you have a budget to where um you spend a certain amount of money on yourself each week or each month or something like that that's it's gonna be cut out of that is what i just heard um so just be mindful on your spending at this time Okay, spirit. I don't like. I'm gonna need a cut. I'm gonna need a plate up underneath that a saucer. Yes, this is an Aquarius channel, but I am drinking out of a Gemini cup. Mhm. Mm I love me some air signs. Yeah, y'all would have. <laughs> Spirit just brought me back to a conversation I had earlier. <laughs> Look, dance, manifest strength. So you could be dancing more free, more free verse is what I just heard. So free verse. So you could be like exploring music or I just heard musical. So somebody might want to take you to a musical propose. Ooh. So somebody may propose to you at a musical. Spirit. I thought we was doing a, a reading on self-care and self-love. We are. This is not my how is this self-love and self-care? <laughs> love 10 of one love that's what it is love 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 
Butterflies could be significant. My daughter has a butterfly. Who is that? Stalker alert. That's all I heard. <laughs> so, <laughs> I got a notification from TikTok for a new follower. And Spirit just says stalker alert. So, there could be fake profiles, stalkers, skincare, manifest strength. Okay, so somebody could be manifesting strength at this time. Why is my, why is that light on? Thank you. It's our bedtime. I put her to bed 10 minutes ago, right before I got on here. Okay. All right, Spirit, what do we have for the collective? Okay. I don't know if y'all saw that. I'm gonna try to like lean this down a little bit so you can see. You see how that fell out? We got one, two, and then three. I was just making sure y'all saw that. Okay, that was it. 11.22 on the clock. Because I'm going to take the top of each one that fell out. And then that's going to be out of this deck. Okay. And for anyone, if y'all want to know what this deck is, it is the self-care oracle. We have digital detox at the bottom of the deck. 35. And we just talked about stalker alert. Okay, so there's somebody on there that has at least four to five pages or four to five people that are watching you on the platform. So, like, if one person has, like, a Facebook, they're watching you from that. If someone has a TikTok, they're watching you from that. If someone has an Instagram, like, it's, it's so many. You see all these? It's so many. So there could be more than four, four or five. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That's too much spirit. <laughs> I don't know why. I went to burp and it just like belched out like that. Oh my gosh. So you could be like, You could laugh every time you get a notification now or like a friend request or like a message from somebody that's like just odd. Just like, hold on, you only got 300 followers, no videos up. How'd you even get to my page? Like, <laughs> that is what I'm hearing. Like, how? Okay, so call mom. Okay, so... You and your mom could be connecting more at this time. There is a healing between mothers that is that is happening right now. Um, that is for the highest good. You could have had a situation where you had to look from a higher perspective when it came to... Um, your mother and how she played a role in your life but also how you played a role in her life the things that happened between you and your mother is going to be mended okay after this is healed i'm hearing that the your mother or whoever this mother is that you have a, a situation with um she is going to be on your ancestor docket so like the the one of the people one of okay so your ancestors um are not always the people that passed away so we could have um elders elders are also called ancestors um, so this person is going to be on your ancestral docket in the physical, your spirit team. Yeah. So this mother just got initiated into the spirit team, into your spiritual team. Oh, congratulations. 
And before this, this actually brings me to what I wanted to read. Um, so I bought this book from a yard sale the other day. Um, and Spirit has been guiding me to um, the messages and the quotes that um, are in here. And it's from Eleanor Do Doan, I think it's called. Uh, Eleanor Doan. Okay, but it's the speaker source book of 4,000 illustration, quotation, saying, anecdotes, poems, sentence, seminars, sermons, and attention getters. Okay, well, I was looking for, what word was I looking for, spirit? Um... Oh. oh, disrespect. I was looking at disrespect, okay? But for some reason, disrespect is not in here. So, then they just had me just, I heard, just flip through the pages. So, I started just flipping through the pages and everything. And I came to graduation. Okay. And then there's also one with guide and guidance. And I'm going to read both of them. But graduation, I like this. Um, I believe this is the antidote they was talking about. But graduation means, and this is from the Watchman Examiner. Um, actually, no, it's not. It's from ELD. E-L-D. Um, graduation means, G, going forward, R, ready to... A, accept God's will. D, determine to. U, understand his word. A, alert to. T, temptations. I, interested in. O, others. N, never forgetting that Christ is my helper. All that stands between the graduate and the top of the ladder is the ladder. You were standing, so the ladder is you. The ladder is you. You've been standing in your own way. And I didn't even read this. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. So the ladder is you. Yes. I came to that conclusion. Um, when... The devil almost had me forfeit my spot of where I'm at right now. Came close. Came very, very close. Very close. Um, and it was just a few weeks ago. But it seems just like yesterday because it was a traumatic awakening for me. Um... just because I didn't realize that I had so much like emotions just like built up and everything but a lot of the emotions that were coming back up were already the things that um I worked on healing and I thought I healed fully um but I didn't but then when I prayed about it I woke up the next morning and I went back to those issues that I was um that I really didn't heal and they were there. Like there was no feeling of of hurt or pain or anything. It was just like a light area. And one of those conversations was actually with my mom. Um, and it actually happened today, which was so amazing. I'm so proud of myself. And I'm so proud of just being able to be in that area for my family. Um, the one who's not afraid to get down and dirty with the dang generational curses and find the ones and pick out the ones that we need to work on. Um, and now I'm understanding that with me pointing out, I'm just the pointer. I am just the pointer. 
So I point out the things. Hey, we need to work on this. Hey, we need to work on this as a family, not just you. No, all of us. We need to heal this as a family. You can heal to an extent by yourself. But healing it with your family. But healing it with your family is taking it to another level of curse breaking. Thank you, Spirit. Curse breaking. So, because it's not only you breaking the curses for over your family, it's also helping your family to recognize those curses as well and they're going to work on them as well so continue to be the pointer congratulations you graduated now i'm gonna read it all together in one so then without the g-r-a-b-u-a-t-i-o-n okay so graduation means going forward ready to accept god's will determined to understand his word alert to temptations so you have been catching on to the temptations of what the devil and the demons and the entities that have been trying to attack you as well as your family you you've been looking and and noticing pointing out the temptations that are around you and you have went to Christ. You have went to the most high for it. You focused where you needed to focus. You chose to walk up the ladder. So you're walking up yourself. <sighs> Awakening. Ah, thank you, Spirit. Now, that brings me to this. So if you were guided then this is definitely one for you, okay? This is guide and guidance. If God has called you, don't look over your shoulder to see who was following you. When God shuts and bolts the door, don't try to get in through the window, okay? So, okay, <laughs> all right what i got from that is okay so if you pray to get out of situations okay and then i'm also let me write this one down okay um how do i put it spirit okay all right they said no don't write it down okay so if you prayed to get out of situations and God is leading you out of those situations, do not go backwards. Do not go backwards. So I'm talking about the people there are met Mercury retrograde that try to come back. Whoever is in your life right now on this day, keep them there. Whoever is not, whoever you cut off and tried to come back during Mercury retrograde, leave them there because god shut that door so if you you can go on over there you can go open you can go through that window if you want to god's telling you you can go you can go through that window but is that what you really want to do is that really what you want to do somebody might have tried to come in through your window so if you dead bolted the doors shut oh okay so they're showing me so like you know how when you take your little kid um your children out let's just say we're going to the park today okay we are going to travel to the park but first we have to leave the house so you know how when a young child tries to go and reach for the doorknob and try to open it themselves, knowing that they're not supposed to be opening the door? Well, they go put their hand on the doorknob and then the parent puts their hand on the doorknob as well and then twists it, or might take it off and then twist. Either way. When you ask, okay, I'm hearing between one to three years ago 
so one to three years ago, you were stressed out about a certain situation and you asked God to close that door. This person has been trying to get back in the window this whole time. Sneakily, sneakily, sneakily. The whole time. The whole time. God guided you to hold back from this person and you did just that. And that is why the graduation is here because of the temptation. Interested, temptation, alert to temptation, interested in others. This person was not interested in what you had going on. This person was interested in seeing you fall. There is a card in one of my decks um, where it says they hate you and love you at the same time. Th that feels like a twin flame energy right there. Automatically twin flame energy. They can't hide the truth. Exactly. They can't hide the truth. They cannot hide the truth. So this person is... Okay, so somebody trying to get in through your window. I just heard that's dead bolted too. They can try. <laughs> they can try but it ain't gonna work okay so you heal something with your mom it could have caused you a lot a lot of anxiety when it came to the relationship between your mom or like any females at that if you are in okay so you if you are connected to a male figure um it could be a friend um that have had issues with their mother in the past you're helping them to have less anxiety when it comes to conversations with their mom trauma trauma bond okay so you you two used to trauma bond at one point in time this person's mother's their relationship was getting good and now it's falling back down. The divine is asking you to manifest strength at this time. There's going to be something. Um, this is a warning. Um, I just heard Elizabeth. Danielle. Pamela, Arendelle, Aruba, Ariba. So, okay. So somebody could have a signature like phrase or something where they're saying Arriba, Arriba. Uh, that sounds like Hispanic culture to me. Arriba, Arriba. Yeah, Spanish culture. Okay. Um, I don't even know. I don't even know the names I just said. I was going to write them down. And I, I don't even. I'm going to have to watch this over again. I don't know. We already 29 minutes in. And we on three cars. <laughs> okay, well we channeling. We channeling right now. We just going with the flow. We not we not trying to do anything to yeah, this is a relaxed reading shoot. You could have had a lot of anxiety when it came to your mama as well. Or you got okay, so like if your mom has some genetics uh with like anxiety depression bipolar uh schizophrenia you know any of those that um she was diagnosed with um you could resemble those as well once you two start to heal and work on healing um whatever you two was diagnosed with that's not gonna be um, I'm hearing it's going to be dismantled. 
So all the anxiety, the depression, the bipolar, up and down phase, it's going to be dismantled. 287, 827, or 782 could be significant. <laughs> I just heard area code. I don't know what area codes are 872 or 827, 728, 287. I don't know. I don't know. But they're mixed together somehow. All right, Spirit. What else do you have for us, Aquarius? What else do you have? I'm going to go ahead and use the soul. When a uh, voice of the soul's oracle, I want to see what this anxiety in reverse is because it's right smack dab in the middle. So you could have manifested a healing uh, when it came to the relationship between you and your mama, you and your mother, mom. I just heard you used to think she was a bruja or she used to think you was a bruja. Okay, so I feel like I'm talking to a Hispanic woman at this time. Or this is a Hispanic uh, mother or grandmother that is coming through. Um, she just said Angelica. I'm sorry for not trusting you. But I'm here watching over you. Hmm. Okay. She just said again, I broke up with him a long time ago okay so there may be a confrontation between a mother and a daughter about a uh a relationship somebody is getting news about a relationship that might put them in anxiety we got respect loss and learning to love Mirror effect. Okay, so somebody lost respect when it came to learning about love because you mirrored their energy back to you. A message of love, forgiveness. Soon. Message of freedom. Repression. Mm, backwards. Going backwards. Don't go. Don't go backwards. That's all I heard. Don't go backwards. Don't go backwards. Oh my gosh. What spirit? What is going on? <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Mm, I do know. I don't know why I keep saying I don't know. Because I do know. Mm. What is this anxiety in reverse? <laughs> you. Off top, you. You could be meditating at this time. Uh, finding things, message of love. Mm. Thirty-two, thirty-four could be significant. Thirty-four, thirty-two, you could be seeing those. You chose to send, okay, so I feel like this is a healing between a mother and a daughter. That, that's, that's the, that's, it's, it's plain as day out here with this mom. Mm. You were going to receive, okay, so if, okay, I'm seeing it two ways. 
either you are going to receive a message of love from this mom or this mom is going to start showing you more love there's going to be more situ okay so there's going to be more love energy in the situation between you the in the relationship not situation in the relationship between you and your mother there will not be i'm just hearing no more anxiety it's just all the way so this is a whole like transition a shift you could be teaching okay so something has to do with with exercising This mother could be uh, in fear that she will get hurt during exercising. I just heard I can't do it alone. Okay, so if you ask this mom to exercise with you to get closer to her, and she kind of refused. Now this mom is having anxiety about sending a message or asking you to help when it comes to this, this workout. I just heard I want to work this out. Okay, so there's, okay. So there is a, a, a mother relation, a mother daughter relationship here that is that is being rekindled. Okay. All right. Let's get some messages and see what this mother daughter relationship needs. Somebody to also um, spirit just mentioned as well. Um, if your mother has passed away, and you start feeling anxiety. Um, oh, I'm getting chills. Okay. Really, like, chills all over. I, I don't know. Can y'all see my arms? Look, like, I got chill bumps. Huh, that's weird. Yeah, that's not the same energy. Whoa, crap. <laughs> okay, yo. Woo we just had another one come in the building, okay? Hello. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to be over here. Not in my area. On here. On the table. Come on the table, please. Thank you. Sorry, I have boundaries. <laughs> Okay, so there is also um, spirit is coming through with if this mother um, passed away, if you feel like any sensations or things that are like moving around in the house just randomly, um, they want me to let you know, stop having anxiety because that's just your mom. Your mom is trying to let you know that she's here. She's wanting to work with you in the spirit. Okay. If she's not here anymore, she's trying to get your attention. It's not anxiety. Okay. She could play with your nose. So if you think if like your nose is itching all the time, I know mom be itching. It surprisingly it don't itch right now. But <laughs> um it will. I already know it will. I feel it. Um, but it could be trying to, like, um, touch you on certain places, you know, pull your hair or try to get your attention. Um, but instead of you connecting, you're having anxiety. You may need to, um, I heard Reiki healer. So you may need to go to a Reiki healer, um, to help you to unblock your chakras, there's a blockage somewhere. Um, okay, it's not the root chakra. 
I believe it's the sacral chakra. My tummy just tightened like this. Um, the one like right here. Uh, yeah, there's a blockage in that one. It could also be, nope, that is orange. Yep. Okay. So the orange chakra. <laughs> The orange chakra. Where are my chakras at? Where are my chakras? Where are my chakra cards? Chakra cards. Chakra cards. I just saw them. Spirit, help me out a little bit, please. Ah, there we go. Thank you. Okay. Alright, let's see. We're going to pull them out. That's what we going to do, Okay. Alright, what blockages are in the collective's body right now that they need to focus on? Yeah, I think these are like the second time I use these cards. I didn't even realize how pretty. Hmm. Well, we gonna use them today, right? 41.14 on the clock. Yes, baby. You could be saying 55. 55 could be significant as well. Um, I don't know. For some reason, they're telling me if you're about to play the lottery, um, 32, 7, 2, 8, and 34 could be significant, and 38. Or 23, 43, 83. Okay. What chakras do the collective need to work on when it comes to this anxiety? Y'all didn't hear that, okay? Yeah, I think my baby's asleep, finally. Oh, this is a lot. I'm not taking all of these, spirit. Shoot, we got third eye, third eye chakra affirmations. I am connected with my higher self. It's 81. <clears throat> Root chakra stones, okay? There are a few healing stones that can be used to open, balance, and heal the root chakra. Red, car red carnelian is historically worn for strength and courage. Black tourmaline is used for spiritual grounding. Finally, obsidian, which is a stone of protection. All of these stones can be used for cleansing and balancing the root chakra. Okay, so we was, did say root. Nope, I had my root chakra um, um, incense. Okay, heart chakra affirmations. My heart is free from all wounds of the past. So yeah, you're healing the wounds of the past right now. When it comes to this anxiety between you and your mother or any issues that you have, that you have in the past, the wound. I just heard wound. So a spirit baby could be about to come through. Oh, I just heard babies. Oh, okay. Balancing the root chakra. If your body feels ill at ease, this could suggest its basic needs are not being met. You may have excessive energy where the chakra spins too fast. This can lead to aggressive and dominating egotism. A deficient or slow spinning root chakra indicates a lack of confidence lack of sexual interest, weak willpower, and lack of grounding. There are many activities which can help to balance the chakra. Please find these on the following cards. So root chakra balancing. And then we got the stones as well. So that's confirmation right there that a root, the root chakra is blocked. And then here we go, the, shake, the sacral chakra affirmations i am radiant beautiful creative and enjoy a healthy and passionate life 
Okay. So we got sacral, heart, third eye, and root. And then we got throat chakra, yoga poses. Yoga poses which help to bring, hold on, help to release tension and bring energy to the throat and thyroid, thyroid include camel, plow, cat cow with lion's breath, shoulder stand, and fish pose. Okay. And then throat chakra affirmations. I hear and speak the truth. So you could be speaking your truth at this time as well. And um, it could be causing your mother to have anxiety. She didn't understand how I just heard powerful yet truthful you are. So you speak the truth on a whole different level. And they didn't realize, okay, so this so this mother was involved in shutting off your throat chakra is what I just heard. Thank you, spirit. Yo. She didn't understand you when she was supposed to understand you. Because then it would have understood her on a whole different level. Okay. Heart chakra stones. This chakra is predominantly associated with pink and green stones. Rose quartz can be used to open and heal the heart chakra. This stone also aids sleep. Aids sleep, calms emotions, and remo removes negativity. Jade is also useful to promote emotional and physical well-being. Green calcite calcite is useful to absorb negativity and boost physical immunity so let's see we have the throat chakra third eye heart sacral and yeah throat heart third eye sacral okay but the only ones that have okay so they said the ones that have two cards so that's the root the throat and the heart so those are the ones that needs to be focused on at this time we have at the top throat chakra essential oils and throat chakra affirmations i live in my truth i communicate my truth i am the truth i am motivated to pursue my true purpose Is there anything else on this spirit? I think that's pretty much just plain as day. It was definitely a um, a dying down of this emotional anxiety turmoil. <laughs> is what I just heard. A mother also feels like you're going to leave her out in the cold. Hard to find. Oh, yeah. I wanted these before we got the the chakras out. I'm glad I used these. I think I'm gonna start using those. Definitely. Okay, so the numbers. Okay, we have 26, 10, 17, 67, 73, 81, 34. 32, 54, 58, 7, 2, 8, and 26. Okay? 
All right, so those are what we have right there. Dang, I'm already on here for 50 minutes. Yeah, time flies by. I bet you if I didn't even look up, we would have been on here for another like two hours, two, three hours. But no, I have some other ones. Mm. Confirmation. <laughs> yeah, about to have you go forever. Let's close out this message between this mother and daughter duo. We got purpose. I know what I am here to do. So you're helping this mother walk in her purpose now. You're helping each other. I just heard yin and yang, but on a whole nother level. My hand is itching. I just heard dynamic duo as well. What else, spirit? Dang. Freedom. <laughs> Didn't we just say freedom? Why are my stuff? Did, did I shuffle? Yeah, freedom. I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness at this time. Yay, because you manifest this strength. You, you at this time are manifesting strength, forgiveness, and love. You chose to love yourself, which pushed everyone around you to choose to love themselves as well. You was the catalyst for everyone's change at this time. And you're seeing it firsthand. 5158. Uh, forgiveness. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the, the flow of love. You chose love. You chose love. You chose to walk in love. And when you chose this a lot, I just saw SOS in the smoke. That's why I look like that. That <laughs> Okay, SOS. SOS, y'all. SOS. Uh, what does SOS mean? Ain't that like a signal or something? Like if you stranded somewhere, you could put like the SOS. <sighs> why am I seeing Madagascar? When they're trapped on that island, and then they write SOS in the sand. And then I'm hearing that one song. Somebody save me. And that's all I get. As soon as I started singing it, it went away. I feel like I'm losing myself. Hold on. Uh, this mother also could have picked up a bad habit that is causing her anxiety to skyrocket. I was right, y'all. It was the sacral chakra. I just saw that. I just saw that. I don't want to pull. Do I want to pull or do I don't want to pull? Get the wolf deck. Okay. All right. Spirit, I'll get the wolf deck. All right. Um, what does Aqua, what does the Aquarius need to know moving forward in the connection with this mother? I just saw emotional. So you could be like emotional support for your mother or vice versa.
I just, okay, so I just heard somebody's about to get initiated into being the matriarch of their family. And they don't know it yet. Everyone knows that this person is the matriarch of the family, but the person. Yeah, something's about to switch. I feel it. Okay. What does the Aquarius need to know moving forward when it comes to their mother? Or this woman figure? That's too many. But it's showing fulfillment. So I feel like this this relationship is going to be mended. It, it's, it's, it's on its way up. Yeah, gifts. Someone may offer you nourishment spiritually or emotionally. A time to receive gifts, legacies, time to develop talents could indicate a time in your life to learn how to receive, be, be it friendship, money, or a kind word. Okay. You may receive a gift from this mother figure or this mother figure is wanting to give you a gift. Um, somebody needs to be on the opening end with this heart chakra stat dead mid in the stat, stat dead mid in the middle. Stat dead mid in the middle. <laughs> what the heck? 56, 56. What spirits smack dead in the middle okay i don't know where did it, did it my words just jumbled completely strength and we got manifest strength right here something's about to happen and it's gonna cause you to need a lot of strength this mother may end up needing more assistance than she thought could indicate you are surrounded by obstacles, but you will find extra strength coming to you at this time. Faith will guide you through the storm. I just heard somebody might end up losing their mother to addictions. Or a mother figure. I kept I kept hearing addictions, addictions, addictions. <sighs> yeah, I don't like talking about that because it it hits home. My father was a drug addict. Um I used to suffer from drug abuse. Um, drugs is um, one, of, one side of my family heavy. Um, mental issues on the other side. So, I mean, it's just, hey, family is family. I mean, we all crazy. Everyone crazy. We just trying to, we're just crazy people trying to make a better world. That. I tell my boyfriend today. I was like, baby, we just two crazy people trying to make a, a better place in the world. We just trying to help make a better world. That's it. That's all. That's it. That's all. End of story. The end. <laughs> okay, so what's up with this uh this storm? We got reunion. Opportunity to meet your soulmate. This is an act of destiny. Realization of personal hopes and dreams. A change for the better. Life works in cycles. From the past will come happiness. So remember I said that this person, uh, this mother figure, um is also afraid that you're about to leave them and that's why this reunion here is in reverse 
But then I feel as well that this mother, so if something is about to happen in your life, this storm that is about to happen in your life, your mother was involved in it. She was involved in, because reunion is in reverse. So if you was in a relationship with somebody, this mother was involved in diseasing the relationship. And now this person is having anxiety because everything is calmed down now. Power could indicate a man or woman who is extremely powerful that will soon be coming to your aid. Keep an open mind. You could be developing your own personal power, allowing you to grow and become much stronger. This mother who was involved in fuck it up a reunion is going to take a downfall and it's going to put you in their position of power yet balance you may find it difficult to maintain emotional balance because someone or something in your life is creating obstacles a need for change and realignment see this mother is having leadership <laughs> because you're gonna be in a fucking position what the fuck what ah thank you spirit i say what the fuck because i, I get surprised at my own like how it's coming out. I'm, I'm still human too, okay? I am the collective as well. So when I get the downloads and then when I'm seeing it, when I say it first and then when it comes out, it surprises me as well. I'm, I'm still in the beginning stages, okay? So I'm allowing my personal power to grow. <laughs> That's what I am doing, okay? Yes, leadership. You will either assume or be appointed to a position of leadership and this will be your way of serving others karmic card others could be seeking your advice or support see remember when i told you about you may you could have asked this person um to work out with you like for like a workout buddy and now this person is going to need your assistance there's going to be so the people thank you spirit this is this this switch from a mom and a daughter um thank you spirit people are gonna start asking so when you get into this position of power i feel like you're already there but it's about to like skyrocket these people are going to need your assistance this mother is going to need your assistance outcome even though you are under undergoing many obstacles, you will, you will survive any and all conditions. Many lessons learned, the result of your experiences are presenting the rewards. Yeah. I feel like you broke off so these people could have talked or this mother could have talked you into breaking um a connection with somebody but it was supposed to happen because it was supposed to bring balance with you doing that it puts you in in the state of a leader a leadership and power role when it came to the feminines in your family the feminine the females in your family are looking at you as a hierarchy right now and they're going to start asking you questions like, how, how did you get this done? How did you do that? How were you able to do this? But you, you're short on this. You only make uh, $13 an hour. How are you able to afford this? How can you afford that? How are you still looking like that when you're poor? These people are going to be confused. Loss. Possible separation from a love, partner, friend, or job. Loneliness. Take stock of things before making any, making another decision. Need time to heal and nurture yourself. I 
I feel like with this with this job here as well. Well, it said partner, friend, and job or job. So you could have lost a love partner, a best friend, and a job. Or like these people are trying to lose. Like you, you need an ego check is what I just heard. So these people are about to do an ego check. But then where you're about to go, they're going to start needing your help. Figures balance <laughs> it's time <laughs> what the fuck what else spirit what else do we need to know i'm glad i like these cards entrapment you may feel trapped by a person career money or children you may also feel that things are closing in around you they this will end within nine months planning is needed okay They try to trap you. Look at this bear trap, okay? They're trying to trap you in something. And the divine is not going to let it go through. Because that's not supposed... That's not where you're supposed to be at. It's only for right now is what I just heard. You're about to go somewhere else. Jolted is what I just heard. You could be moving to the mountains. Pay attention to the advice that you receive from people at this time as well they're against your power so the advice that they give you is going to be an underhand slap in the face is what i just heard so like they're going to give you okay so if you gave these people advice before the advice that you gave them for them to try to come back in they're going to use they're going to use your own language. <laughs> Anger. Someone has caused you to become a victim. Uh, someone has caused you to become a victim. Anger. Upheaval causes deep distress. Try to solve the problem. Think before you speak. Don't become a victim. Solution is prayer. Remember I got that yin and yang energy? one light one dark i believe it was at the way beginning you see that yin and yang light and dark i'm also getting to that these people with this reunion card in reverse i feel like these people or this mother was also the cause of putting you and your partner like against each other. There was some type of information that came out defeated. You will feel defeated financially or emotionally at this time. Eliminate waste and be more practical. No more credit. Review unnecessary expenditures. So you need to hold back at this time. Um... If you cut, okay, so I'm hearing if you cut off somebody, this is in get back energy. Everything seems cool right now, but it's the calm before the storm. Get back energy. Somebody's going to try to get you to lose your job, your house, kick you out possibly. All because they're upset. I just heard mama said knock you well. God said knock you well. So I'ma just knock you well. What? Okay, so somebody might end up trying to send somebody to fight you. I just heard it's not gonna it's it's not gonna go well. 
It could be a mother of a child. What else, Spirit? We got wisdom, 33, battle. Yep, yeah, look, a battle. Didn't I just say somebody gonna try to fight you? 39, a battle. At this time, a battle with a loved one or a friend could indicate struggle in career or on the job may lead to an ending. Counseling might be needed, possibly indicating a battle with oneself. Seek peace through prayer or meditation. Power, leadership, and battle. Ah, oh, okay. And be alert. You can find yourself a victim because someone else's jealousy, dishonesty. Be alert. Situation now calls for clarity. This is clarity for me. Thank you, Spirit. A mother could also be jealous because they tried to knock you down or they wanted you to come back to them you're only giving them limited energy is what i just heard so you limiting and taking back your power put you in a leadership role you could have like a platform or something where this karmic mother watches you um hey it's plain as day they showed me karmic they pointed it out so this this mother is a karmic i feel like this isn't the same energy from before so this is another person that's coming in so they this mother and this other mother might have been involved in some some type of spell work thrown and so you separated from these people and put and took your power back you step into the leadership role now these people are battling amongst themselves they're not even battling with you because you already seek through prayer and meditation god told you to pull back And then we got wisdom, 33. Doorways in your mind open. Having you discover talents you never realized you possess. Psychic forces bring you back to ancient roots. Wisdom is gained and the knowledge to use it. Emotion. You may find you are in a situation almost over your head and change must happen for you to survive be true to your feelings know this too will end learn from your experiences you gained the wisdom to control your emotions because you knew what this leadership role if you stepped into your paddle paddle so your pa paddle board paddle okay so a paddle so they might try to give you an ass whooping you want a paddle they try, to, they try to bring back the old school Catholic ass whoopings that they at the schools, you know, where they used to have a big ass fucking wooden paddle. That's what they try. <laughs> Just be prepared because a lot of people are salty at this time. We got emotions, anger, battle here. What? I just heard you tried, you failed. You tried, you failed. You tried, you failed. Drink your tea. It's coffee, actually, but drink your tea. Mm -mm. Okay. That's all I can say. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Now we're going to get some tea on this. Since y'all want to do... <sighs> yeah the reading was so good but see that see i felt something underneath with the anxiety this mother is having anxiety for what she did whatever she did i feel like you don't even know i feel like you playing it so cool like you know but you don't know no you don't know what happened you just knew you just know something went down yeah, see, look, they hate it from afar. A house fire could be significant. Here we go with that dang house fire energy again. Oh, spirit. Shut up. 
Should I do this deck first or should I do the Kipper deck? Kipper, okay. Uh, look, we got GPS tracker at the bottom of the deck though. So these people could be trying to track you. Okay, spirit. Who was in their feelings? What what's what's going on with this anger, battle, power? They're upset. They're battling with themselves because you know put yourself in this leadership power. Your whole mindset could have changed. Like you're just working on yourself, not paying attention, is what I just heard. So pay attention to what? Oh, to them. You're not paying attention. Yeah, we look. We got a mature woman, a courthouse, main male, concern, a message of concern, great fortune, another message, and a wealthy man. So your mother snitched. Your mother is a snitch. Expectation. Mature woman, courthouse, May male, concern, message of concern, great fortune, message, wealthy man. Okay. Your mother snitched to a main male about a relationship or this could be a mature woman that wants to take a main male to court and now he's concerned a message of concern about this great fortune this is getting a message from another person Somebody has to go to court because they stole something or they did something with somebody else's money. They took somebody else's money and now they're concerned that this person may end up taking them to court. Okay. All right. That's enough of that. <laughs> I don't know what the heck that was. Side note. Okay, spirit. One card, please. What's going on with this situation, with this battle and anger? Ah, oh, so now they don't. You see how the cards don't want to fly now? They don't want to work. They don't want to work. They don't want us to know. What is... Tell us something. It house. All right. So this is about a house. And we got house fire up on it. Mm-mm. Hmm, what's up with this house? We got occupation and family room. This person or this mother figure feels. Okay, so you could work from home but you're about to actually work from your physical home. Poverty. A woman is concerned that she's about to lose her job or this could be a house. I just heard I lost the house, I lost my job, I lost everything. Poverty. And lovers, because they try to attack this lover. But they didn't realize that y'all were in high honor. The courthouse and main mail. Concern, bad health, imprisonment, change, unexpected income. Yeah, they tried to steal this main male's money. What the fuck? And they're upset because you, you caught them. Early is what I heard. Early. So you could have said this like way before shit even started happening. And now it's about to start playing out. What else, spirit? Yeah, we got journey. They're going to have to leave. 
Or you could end up being... Okay, so you could end up taking a trip. A thief. They're trying to leave. Somebody is trying to leave. We got 1020 here. So something could happen at 1020. We got 120, 25 on the clock. Twenty twenty one could have been significant. Something could have happened in twenty twenty one. Something could have happened in twenty ten. But we got ten, twenty, thirty four, and twenty one. What is this journey, occupation, family room, and house? That wanted to flip out. Unexpected money. They thought they was going to have some unexpected money and take this trip. This person could be secretly trying, so this mother could be secretly trying to take a vacation with your money. Somebody went back and changed something. For a direct deposit. So money could get put into one account. And not the original account. 27 could be significant. Somebody could find this out. It was this October. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. Yeah. October 27th. Could be significant October 21st, October 20th. We got message of concern 14. That was in reverse. I don't, I don't read reversals. Ten fourteen could be significant. February 7th of 2014 could be significant as well. January 27th, January 21st, January 20th, January 14th. February 14th could be significant. March 4th, February 1st, February 7th. What's this message of concern, Spirit? I'm going to clarify with my dad. 23, 23 on the clock. What is this message of concern? Concern and bad health. Okay, 33 could be significant. We keep seeing 33 everywhere. Be alert. They're taking me back to this be alert. Okay, so somebody might end up in long journey. I feel like somebody about confirmation. Somebody about to get sick. 31 could be significant as well. An imprisonment. A change. To main male's great fortune. Somebody's not getting some money. I mean, that that's that's all I'm seeing. I'm seeing a big red X and message. <laughs> message. A wealthy man. A wealthy man is not getting money. I just heard faked a court case. So this, there is a wealthy man that could have faked a court case to try to get some money or try to set you up for a court case. And now they're getting the message of concern that they're not about to get this money. 
yeah house occupation family room journey unexpected money message of concern concern wealthy man and message that right there they somebody not getting some money somebody is not getting some money in yeah, that courthouse nope nope they don't they don't even want me yeah nope that's plain as day yeah somebody about to get a message that they're not about to get some money and it's gonna be their karma for whatever they're trying doing to you it could have been with this gps tracker july 13th could be significant july 14th july 27th july 10th july 21st july 20th uh so we have 20 34 21 10 27 14 33 13 and 7. The only two months that are out here are um, October and July. So July and October could be significant for somebody. I just heard two, two, two. Dang, it got dark that fast outside, y'all. Well, we are on here for an hour and 30 minutes. Yeah, I'm about to wrap this up. Because this is going to take forever to upload. But, I mean, shoot. It is what it is. I mean, spirit led us to it. <laughs> we was all cool. We was all cool. Gucci. Everything. <laughs> and then it was like, alright, we're going to give you a little bit more. Shoot. We just got to pour it on you, pour it, pour it, pour it on you, let it, let it, pour it on you. Like a hot summer day with some ice cold water. Control issues. So these people had control issues. Okay. What do we need to know, Spirit, when it comes to this situation? Give me three cards. One for this house. Yeah, give me one more. For this concerned wealthy man and message. Mm. Mm, my nose is itching, spirit. I can't. Not tonight. Not tonight. Not tonight. Not tonight. No. Meditate to gain clarity, though. So. Uh, hmm. All right, so we got to take a break. So with this house, occupation, and family room, that's definitely taking a break. So this person may want to try to take you out on a break or like a vacation, and they're going to realize there's, there's going to be a message to where they can't. They're not going to be able to go. Ah. I don't even have to say it. I do not even have to say it. Somebody's about to get a message of concern. I just heard body bag. So somebody might die in a fire, in a fire, a house fire. And this is their karma. This is going to allow you to take a break. Oh, gosh, I hate kids. Why, spirit? But you're going to need to meditate to gain clarity on this. I just heard there's only one person that is safe. What else is the spirit? Is take a break, house fire, and body to body snatch. We got their hating from afar. Yeah. 
they could have got a message of concern that they're not about to get like everything they're not about to okay so somebody might retaliate with the house fire or this is what these people are planning a journey house fire unexpected income message of concern so somebody might end up having a house fire it could be an accidental house fire and then they were waiting on some money they're gonna find out that this money is not here yeah can't think straight 444 ancestors are with you have faith your prayers are being loud heard loud and clear feel beyond your aura so this time you need to take yeah you're untouchable you need to take the time. Yeah, because you have supernatural DNA. Anime could be significant. I just heard... I just heard watching anime helps you to unlock your gifts. I actually have noticed that because a lot of anime, um, at least the ones that I watch, it has a lot of, like, spiritual aspects to it. Um... And that that could be, but it also but just be, just be aware because when you with anime, sometimes some some TV shows could go a little bit too deep into it, um. So you just have to be aware and be mindful of what type of energy you want to bring into your mind at this time um, because watching anything can poison you is what i just heard what else spirit for this situation what is this message of concern take a step back look at your accomplishments and take a break so it's time for you okay so the divine is saying don't even worry about this they hate it from afar we got all this we got this we got this yeah meditate i don't feel like they're they're not giving me much on this except for this house fire and this body to body snatch ancestors watching like what the fuck is going on <laughs> what is this message of concern or they could be they could be concerned because they're taking a look back. They're they're taking a step back and they're looking at all the things that you've accomplished. Someone gave divine masculine, divine feminine's address, new new too great, GPS tracker. Somebody is going to try to okay, so this person is salty. They think that they're gonna try to set up a house fire because your new new is too great and you don't want to go back to this fuckery is what i just heard fuckery fuck fuckery fuck 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 and they're emphasizing on the f F fuckery fuck -ery. gps tracker so they're fucking with your car And look, meditate came right back out on here. Okay, so they, I gotta take it. That's the third time it came out. Watch out, stalker alert. Didn't I just say that? Ah! Ah! What's this house fire, man? Can you tell us anything from this deck with this house fire? Can we restart? No. If someone is undercover. <sighs> we got some more and my nose is itching again using you for sexual energy harvesting but you're divinely protected because you raised your vibration or you need to raise your vibration so this person is upset because they can no longer sexually harvest they can no longer sexually energy harvest off of you they wanted to restart but now they're going to try to catch your house on fire set your house on fire this person could know where your mom lives oh man try it if you want to i wish your motherfucker would try it if you want to try it if you want to we gonna have some issues don't worry 
raise your vibration. It's okay. Ain't nothing a little black sock can't help. And a few other things. I'm not gonna give my little my little uh mm -mm. cause I know you watch my videos, so I ain't giving you nothing at all. Mm -mm. You ain't getting what I use to protect myself. Fuck that. You could bounce back on that undercover D you own because <laughs> I defeated you. Back, 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 back. A 10. Huh? That's how we do it over here. Military style, baby. The fuck? Mm. okay so using you for sexual energy harvesting i'm also getting if this person was taking your energy back to someone else like yeah they was bringing it back to somebody else or multiple people This person may be not be able to set the house on fire or anything like that because there might be too many casualties. I'm also hearing that there could be somebody is about to overdose and this person that is hating from afar is going to find the person I'm hearing either in the living room or the kitchen and they're going to set they're going to set it up to make it look like it was a house fire. Pay attention to what's in your drinks as well. I just heard um uh poisoning. So we got Galactic Grandmother and we have Thus One Journeys thus this one's journeys to the stars okay so you have a grandmother mm, with this spider i just saw a black widow so a black widow might be down y'all we got this mother energy over here and it don't have to be like your exact mother it could be like an auntie a sister you know anyone in the feminine energy really you see, we got that black widow and that little human being inside. This is what that person tried to do to you. They try to swallow you whole. But look at this. Y'all are both in that circle. That is the divine circle with all the eyes. Yeah, there's eyes around that. The divine is watching this. They thought they swallowed you whole. Find your star family in this cosmic game of hide and seek. Body to body. So you not. <clears throat> I just realized something. Okay. Okay. We're going to get to this. Okay. So. I have noticed what I came to the conclusion about energy and definitely with the different signs that we have. Um, so for some reason, I kept asking myself, I was like, and I think I, I believe I was talking to my grandmother who passed away. It was, yeah, it was one of my grandmothers. I can't remember which one. Um, but I believe it was on my dad's side. Uh, Big Mama. Yeah, it was Big Mama. Yep. <laughs> so I was talking to my Big Mama. And I was asking her. I was like. I had somebody come back during Mercury retrograde. And he mentioned something back in October. 
that he came to a realization. Um, and I was like, hmm, October. What was going on around that time? Hmm. There was also a Mercury retrograde in October. Hmm. And somebody else also came back. But weird, because it was a, it was the same sign, but different face. Mm. Mm mm mm. Mm mm. When I caught on to that shit right there, <laughs> I realized that motherfucker cycle and cut that off. I was like, uh uh, fuck this energy. Nope. Cut it completely off. I don't know who needed to hear that. Don't look at the faces. Check the energy. That is what the divine said. Don't check the faces. Because they're going to make it seem like it good. And it look good and all shiny and sparkly. Everything like that ring on my finger. It's going to be looking good. They might even try to use your lingo. Check the energy. Because the energy is going to tell you what you need to know off tops. Off tops. And it's so funny how that I'm mentioning that because I got a random person message me the other day on TikTok and like I picked up on the energy and I was like, uh, stalker, uh, like I closed that down real quick. Like you try to be my sugar daddy, but I'm just like, I don't need a sugar daddy. Ew, no, I do not want $5,000 from you a week. That ain't what? No, boo boo. Mm mm. Block. And then I messaged, I messaged before I even did that. He was like, no, I'm, I'm for real. I'm for real. I promise. I promise. And I'm just like, okay, that was the same fucking energy that promised me two months ago that tried to fucking scam me beforehand. Same energy, same person, same face. Not again. Catch yourself before you wreck yourself. For real. Because, mm, you see what that says right there? Ancestors watching, body to body, snatched. I don't even think I have to say anything else. I don't have to say anything else on that topic. At all. Because someone is going down. I just heard in the next two weekends. You may hear about this. Or you may not. You may not hear about this. You're going to feel it. You're not going to hear it. Mm. This person too could have just tried to come back because they saw you back on top. And they only confirmation. They only wanted you for sex. This person was gonna feed you a false dream like the one before. Get you where you wanted you to knock you off your pedestal. <laughs> One second. Where is that? Where is that spirit? Thank you. I know my ear is itching. Where is that? To grow tall spiritually, a man first must must learn to kneel. As you grow better, we meet better people. This person tried to knock you off of your high horse. They said that you were too... Too spiritually inclined. So when you pray, you might not pray kneeling down. You may pray standing up. 
or like in a certain way And this person think, yeah, this person wanted to try, yeah. I will expect that great things from God and I will expect great things for God. There never was any heart truly great and gracious that was not also tender and compassionate. Great men are known by their deeds, the rest of us by our mortgages. Ha <laughs> ha, that's the thing. That's the thing. This person was looking at at third um so you look from things at a spiritual point this person looks at things from a physical point and when i just i'm gonna reread it again let me reread that again Great men are known by their deeds, the rest of us by our mortgages. So these people were known for physical, tangible things. Yep, yeah, thank you, Spirit. My nose is itching again. For physical things, you are known by your deeds. So if you give, so it doesn't matter if you're struggling, you will give somebody the, the, I just put the foot in the back. What the hell? You will give. That's that karmic saying that. Thank you. Thank you, Grandma. Yeah, check him. Get him out of here. Okay. One second. Okay, so these people or this woman or whoever this person is, this undercover freak using sexual energy harvesting asshole, that's what I'm going to call it, asshole, we'll just call it that. This person was on the tangible. They wanted the tangible. It was supposed to be... Um, yeah, I see on different lengths, on different levels. It's not the same. I just keep getting that song. I don't even know the words to the song, y'all. But now it's saying, Spirit said, knock you down. So this, so this person could actually work with like dark forces or like has like a, a witch doctor or something that they go to they little femi females is what i just heard feminine females um they uh yeah i just lost my train of thought mm. i'm rebooting I've been out here too long. <laughs> Say you take it too long. Dang! One hour and 48 minutes and 48 seconds? Oh, yeah, we got to go. Okay. All right, I got to get to the other download. We we cracking on this one, y'all. Let's get us a spirit animal to close out the reading. What messages do we need to know from our spirit animal? One card, please, to close out the reading. These will these uh will probably so today is Monday the twenty fifth, I believe. We're in April, right? Yeah, I believe I believe it's Monday the twenty fifth. Um I may post these tonight. I may not, depending on how long um, my reading goes for the other download. And then I'm going to try to post um, a reading to my TikTok channel. So they may or may not be up tonight. They may be on the 25th. 
Um, just keep a lookout for that. Please make sure you are liking, subscribing, commenting, as well as sharing. I really appreciate each and every one of y'all that do it. And I love each and every one of y'all, even though I cannot see y'all faces. Even the karmic, the ones that are just paid to watch me, that just sit on here. Thank you for at least giving me a view. I really do appreciate y'all as well. Everyone does not have to continue to be a karmic. You can change at any point in time. God's waiting on you. All I got to do is change. That's it. Choose to change. But then also, just because you say, oh, I choose to change. God, I change. You still have to put in the work. You still have to put in the work. You got to think about it. Just because you're not a karmic to one person, you could be a karmic to another person. So you got to think about that. You have to be aware of the cycles and the karmic cycles um, that you are to people and that they are to you. It's, it's a lot more to it than just breezing on by. No, that's why this is the, lo the road least traveled. Because a lot of people don't want to go down this rabbit hole of self-healing. Because everything starts with the inner self. Everything. Everything. If you're not right, it's going to show on the outside. Thank you, Spirit. Confirmation. It will show on the outside. 51, 51 on the clock. So we got to be mindful. Mindful, everyone. That's it. Just be mindful. And show love. Unconditional love. If somebody crossed you, you ain't got to get back. Don't be in no fucking get back energy. Just say, all right, I'll catch you later. And keep it pushing. Heal, keep it pushing. That's it. Ain't no get back. Where they do that shit at? We grown over here. Are you trying to have people get beat up and using people for sexual energy? Like, come on now. All right, ancestors. All right, spirit animals. What spirit animal want to come out today for aquas? For us Aquarians. What do? What want to wants to come out today? We got eagle mastery. Yes. Yes, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Yes. And then we got Black Jaguar. Oh, so walk through life with confidence and grace. You have power from beyond the world. Focus on what you really want. You can create your dreams. Exactly. You create your own dreams. What you feel on the inside is going to be reflected onto the outside. What you see on the inside is just a reflection. It's a game. It's a game. If you know, you know. I'm not about to sit here and explain it to you. Perception. Come on. Wake up, collective. Come on now. Eagle. Mastery. Yes, you are on a spiritual journey beyond the sky. Let go of the past and soar. You are guided by the winds of spirit. Your wisdom inspires the world. Be that eagle. Because although you may not see it, the people are around you are learning from you. Just by you being you. And you choosing to be this eagle and soar and be on your spiritual path. You are helping to awaken the people that are in your life. And even the ones that you don't see on a daily basis. They are also being healed. And they soon, too, will be masters of their own. But first, you. Focus on you, Aqua. Ooh, and my ear started ringing. All right, is there anything else that we need? Mm, yes, we're going to ask ourselves a question. So, you know, I like my get my deep. Ooh, excuse me. 
my deep cards. We gonna get this and then we gonna end it in two hours. <laughs> I've been on this baby for two hours. If you made it this far, thank you very much. I really appreciate y'all. Please like, 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 like. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, select all. So anytime that you see, anytime I post anything, you will get a notification on your phone or a tablet or wherever you watch YouTube at. It will be on there. Yeah, my cards just bent all the way up. Oh, I hate when they do that. All right, let's get deep. Let's get deep, y'all. Let's get deep. Let's get deep. Those ain't even. Okay. What questions should Aqua ask themselves for this week? What questions should they ask themselves? If you could have chosen a different location to grow up in, where would it be and why? Hmm. Ooh, that is a good question. That is a very good question. Hmm. Um, let's see. For me, I was born and raised in Utah. We moved here when I was a young child to Indiana. Um, I love the mountains. But I wouldn't want, I want somewhere where it's hot, but then it also has mountains. So like somewhere down south, but it, it don't get cold. I want, I want the heat. I want to be able to wake up every morning and sit on my front porch or my back porch, my patio, sipping on my coffee and it not get cold. <laughs> and me not get cold. Sign of synchronicity. I don't know where that is in this world. I just know that I, I want to move somewhere where it's warm. Um, but if I could have chosen a different place to grow up, I would have to say I, I would really, I would have liked to stay in Utah. Um, just because... Uh, my dad lives there, um, and now that I'm rekindled back with him, um, now that I'm back in Indy, I finally found him, <laughs> and he's in Utah, and I was in Utah, and I'm just like, dude, where you at? But then it's the moment I come back to Utah, the moment I come back to Indiana, he pops back up. So that is a sign that me and him are not on the same wavelengths. Um, when it comes to uh, meeting face to face, um, I have a physical father here. Uh, although he is my stepfather, um, my birth father uh, is my spirit father, my spiritual father, and then my stepfather, which is the one that married my mom. Um, he is my earth father. I connect with my birth father on a whole different spiritual level. Completely different. Uh, 5858 on the clock. 15858. Um, than I do with my stepfather. I don't know why that was a significance. Um, but yeah. If I were to choose where I grew, where I would, if I could choose, if I could have chose a different location to grow up, I would have chose Utah. I would have not chose Indiana. But then again, as well, I don't even believe I would change it because then I don't think I would have met my twin flame when I did. I think it would have went totally different. So I'm I'm indifferent. I I don't know. But if I could choose a location now to finish growing up <laughs> and to live my life, definitely somewhere down south where it's hot and it's there's mountains. And green. I love green. 
I love seeing green, green, green leaves, um, green trees, green grass, um, the brightness, the, the radiant color. That's what, that's what I want to see. Just like a field of green, just everywhere. But yeah, so. All right, y'all, that's two hours on the clock. Y'all, we made it. We did it. Y'all, I love y'all to death. I love y'all even before and after death. Like, they, well, death, you can't even say death because, I mean, they gonna have to figure out a new word for that. All right, y'all. Hmm. I'm about to take a little break and then I will get on here for this other uh, three readings that I have to do. Um, yeah, so I think that is it. Yeah, the energy done died down. There's nothing else to say. Thank you, spirit. And most high for giving us the messages that we needed today. And thank you for it being a lot more organized. Um, I've actually been working on that. Um, I've asked Spirit to help with my organization because of my past videos. Um, definitely with the decks that I made, I noticed that a lot of them tend to just... We have an excessive amount of them on the table at all times. And these, I refrain from pulling a lot, um, which I also felt it in the deck um, that we wasn't going to get as many cards today. Um, well, at least for this reading, when it came to what's going on. Um, I don't feel like we needed a... An excessive amount so I'm gonna try to pull back from pulling all of those um, because a lot of my downloads that I get are starting to become jumbled together um, in the readings and I want to keep everything separate I, I want to have one reading for one reading for one reading for one reading so This main male or this wealthy man that came out here, they're working with either a mother figure or a woman who has children. I just got that. 713. So you may find this out July 17th. I mean, July 13th. 713. You may receive a message from this wealthy man. All right, y'all. That's all I have for y'all today. I love y'all. From the bottom of my feet to the top of my head. Okay, I love la 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 Yes, because right now. Okay, star family. All right. I'm gone. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Love ya.